City of mine. How I love, how I love the city of mine. It never gets me down. City of mine. How I love, how I love the city of mine. It never gets me down. Yeah. To be quite honest, I did miss it more than I thought I would. Welcome back to my channel or hello if you guys are new. It's a very exciting video because I'm going to New York. It's Saturday at about nine o'clock. We are about to catch our flight. My mom is going with me for a few days and then Aiden's gonna come up for the rest of the week because we're there for a week. He just can't take off like a whole week of work so he's coming up for half of it, but I'm so excited. If you guys don't know, I used to live in New York. I lived there for four years and I moved back in 2020, so I haven't been back since. And so I'm a little bit nervous, but also really excited. We got all, <laughs> we got all of our stuff all packed. Aiden's about to drop me off at the airport. We're mainly going to see my niece Claire because my brother lives there and my sister-in-law lives there. So we're mainly seeing them and of course doing some other things too. And because I feel like I might get questions, my sweater is from Target, my bodysuit's from Target, my rings are from Ana Luisa, as well as my necklaces that I'm wearing. got to our hotel room so i'm gonna give you guys a little tour we're staying at a sonder property we're in the city hall one and it's so pretty we just walked in and we're gonna get ready to unpack our stuff and then get some groceries because we have a kitchen which is really nice i'm so thankful for them because they are gifting us this day for this trip so i'm so thankful but if you guys don't know sonder has a ton of different places basically all around the world they have a ton in New York City as well. There's just so many different options. And when we were looking to come here, they had a bunch of different locations in the city. Then you walk in, you got our bed, got so many windows, <laughs> sorry. And we got our kitchen, which is so pretty. It's like super well stocked. They left us some candies, which was so sweet. This little taxi cab, so pretty right now. Got our bed. I'm gonna unpack some stuff and put it in the closet and then when you come over here we have our bathroom which is very interesting this very modern shower got our sink area just so spacious i'm so used to staying in such small places when i come to new york that this is so nice just having all this space you basically do everything through the app so you can order extra towels if you need them or you can do like a late checkout and when we checked in here you just put in your access code so it's really easy it's contactless and you can just head up to your place so it's really simple to get in also really simple to book and everything's just really nice and modern and feels really new. I also wanted to say that I'll have a link to Sonder down below if you guys are going anywhere. I will show you guys how we're enjoying our stay throughout the week. So really excited. I think right now we're just going to do some unpacking and then go get some groceries like I mentioned and find something for dinner. It's about five o'clock so I feel like the sun's gonna start setting soon. So we're just gonna get settled in and enjoy the night. Wait. getting ready for dinner i just put on this black top which i thrifted a while ago and then my jeans are from zara these are just the wide leg ripped jeans and then i'm probably just gonna throw on some sneakers try not to wear my shoes inside also got on my hope necklace we're going to a place called malibu farm in the seaport district so i've never been there but i'm very excited it looks good we're gonna eat outside by the water back to our hotel room which is so nice we just got in bed my mom's taking a shower but we're about to head to sleep and have a fun day tomorrow i'm really excited we we're trying to figure out what we wanted to do 
Um, the restaurant was so good tonight. They were so nice. It took a while for our food to come out and so they gifted us those desserts, which was so sweet. And then we walked around and looked at the view. It was so nice, but I'm about to head to sleep so I will catch you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys. It's our first full day here. It is Sunday today, so it's around 10 o'clock. I went ahead and grabbed some coffee this morning, went for a walk, went for the pier, which was so nice. It's like the most beautiful weather here lately. We picked such a great week to come. We're actually gonna meet up with my brother, so that's like the main reason why we're here, like I told you guys, because we're meeting my niece, Claire. They have church, and then we're gonna meet up with them for lunch slash brunch, but I think before then, we're pretty close to the Brooklyn Bridge, which is why I like this Sonder location, because it's at City Hall, so it's really close to like everything downtown. We're gonna walk the Brooklyn Bridge. That's like my favorite touristy thing to do. It's actually something that I think is super fun. It can get a bit crowded, Probably will be crowded today because it's so nice out and it's a weekend, but I still think it's so fun I love it. I think we're just gonna walk across and then probably uber back and meet them I think after this we're headed over to their apartment um, as well to see their apartment and everything I haven't seen they recently moved not recently I think probably like six months ago They moved into their apartment, so I haven't seen it since they moved from their old one So I'm really excited. I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. I got this from Zara I've been obsessed with Zara lately. This is my dress. I'm wearing it's kind of like completely shapeless I'm just gonna wear sneakers, but I think that it's so cute. Just this polo dress, has a slit, and yeah, it's definitely not the most flattering. It's kind of just like a box, but I love wearing stuff like this in New York and just throwing on sneakers because it's so comfy when you're walking around. And because we have a big day of walking around, I just figured this would be good. And it also really matches with my nails that I got done recently. on here pretty much at all today but we had a very busy day we walked the brooklyn bridge and then we went and met up with my brother and avery and got some sandwiches and then went back to their apartment and just hung out had dinner over there and so got to spend a lot of time with claire but i hadn't updated you guys all day so it's like nine o'clock we just got back to our place i'm about to take a shower because i feel like my face is just so greasy after the day and like wearing a mask i feel like it just takes off all my makeup so i'm feeling very sleepy i need to do a bit of work because my podcast goes up tomorrow so i need to do some stuff on that i'm gonna get in bed and do that but take a shower put on my pajamas good morning guys it is monday we just woke up. My mom actually ran to the grocery store. She's grabbing us some stuff, just some ice, and then she needed to grab something too, so I just stayed back. I'm doing a little bit of work this morning. I just need to shoot something and send it in. And then for the rest of the day, it looks like today is gonna be another really beautiful day, so we are going to meet my brother in Central Park and hang out there. I feel like we'll do some more stuff, because that's really the only thing that we had planned, but for now, that's it. This is my mom's last full day here in New York, and then tomorrow, her flight's in the evening, so. I think we'll just be hanging out. I really wanted to make my iced coffee this morning because I like making my iced coffee at home. I think it tastes better. I filled up our ice trays last night. I realized I just stuck them in the fridge instead of the freezer so we don't have ice. So my mom's grabbing some. That was so dumb of me. I forgot to mention this, but yesterday while we were out, it was so funny. I met one subscriber, which always makes my day. And then we were also waiting to get our breakfast and I saw Elena Tabor. I was like, is that her? And then it was her. We talked to her a little bit, but I had met her once at an event in New York and it's just so crazy in New York it's such a big place but you always see people that you know it's just crazy Same, just wide leg, rip 
Perfect jeans. And then my top is also from Zara. And in the jeans, I'm wearing a size 26 from Zara. And then my necklaces are from Ana Luisa. Actually, I have a code. It's Michelle Reed, and you just get 10% off with that. But I love them. I think that they're so pretty, along with my hoops. room yeah with the plants we came by to see my old apartment the upper west side it was right up there got lots of good mems here this is a good spot of course someone's walking by with a speaker we have been back in our hotel for a little bit after today but we're about to go grab some dinner over kind of near Tribeca. So we're gonna get an Uber and go over there. Feeling very comfy today because we're gonna be eaten by the water. I feel like I'm gonna get cold. So just bundled up and we are about to head out. We've just been chilling here for a couple of hours after being out today. Golden things. Gold hair. Gold rings. Gold leaves. It is Wednesday morning and I decided to come over to Brooklyn Heights this morning, which in my opinion is the best neighborhood. I'm not used to volume public here. I used to live here in my freshman and sophomore year of college and I feel like that's when a lot of people join my channel, so it's just a really special place. We got engaged on the promenade. I was going to wait until Aiden was here because he comes tonight. Because obviously this is a special place like for both of us. We started dating here. But it says it's going to rain for the next few days. So just in case, I wanted to make sure I saw it when it was nice out. Because I just have so many memories here. It's like such a special place for me. And it's obviously just like everywhere is so beautiful around here. So I just decided to come over. I was going to walk around the pier close to where we were staying. But just decided to come over here instead. And I'm so thankful I did because it's like the most beautiful day out right now and it's definitely making me really nostalgic i obviously wish he was here i think we'll definitely come back again when he gets here but for now it's really special hotel and I'm about to get ready for the day because for today's plans my mom's babysitting Claire and then she heads home tonight so she's gonna go up to their apartment and then I'll probably meet her after but I'm grabbing breakfast with my friend Rose you guys know Rose she still lives in the city so I'm gonna go see her new apartment and then also grab I think like a brunch situation with her so excited for that but I definitely need to get ready I have you propped up on a water bottle right now but I'm doing my makeup and I wanted to say that I started using the Grande Lash, like the lash serum that's supposed to grow your lashes and I have noticed so much. So I wanted to show you guys after I put on my mascara. I think I have a code that gets you 15% off, I'll put it here. And I am obsessed. I've been using it for a few months now and with my hair just thinning out a lot, I have noticed such a difference in my eyelashes. Like I don't think you guys will be able to see that much but they were so short and stubby before. I love it. It's worked so well. I'm using the eyebrow one right now, but I haven't really noticed anything with that. But I do really like the eyelash one. And I feel like usually that stuff's pretty gimmicky, but it's just really cool that it actually works. just got back from a long day it's about six o'clock i'm actually here by myself my mom left for the airport and i already miss her i'm so happy that she got to come with me because 
I've talked about this in a recent video, but it's so nice just getting one-on-one -on -one time with your parents. And yeah, it was just so sweet getting to stay in this like beautiful place with her and get to show her all of my New York spots that I love. So it was really sweet. It's like sad to say bye to her, but Aiden is coming tonight. So I actually have all of these sheets that we're going to switch out with so nice with Sonder. They just brought us new sheets right away. You just do everything through the app, which is so nice. You just message and they do it right away. So I like love staying here. I just went and grabbed some snacks too. And I just love it. I love it, how it feels like it's your own apartment, but it's nice. Like they have the amenities. Yeah, it's like the ideal stay. I would highly recommend. I know they are working with me for this video, but I definitely plan to use them in the future because it's just so nice if you're someone who kind of likes to do your own thing and feel like you're living in the city that you're visiting. I think it's a great option because I just got here. So just eating some grapes. My mom bought these, which was so sweet. I always feel so fancy when I get these pre-cut things because they're so nice, but my mom got these, which is really sweet. So having a snack, gonna shoot some content and then wait for Aiden. Wednesday morning, Aiden is with me. I just made him wake up because I want to go get bagels before he needs to start work for the day and go try to walk by the water a little bit. It's like a 20 minute walk before he needs to start. So that's what we're doing. Just threw on my hoodie because I don't really know what the weather's like outside. And I'm excited. It's a very gloomy day today. It's actually pretty cloudy, which is like the first cloudy day that I think we've had here since we've been here. So. has to work here today so i am gonna go out go to soho and grab something and then also probably walk around tribeca because it ended up being really sunny which is nice so you guys my outfit pretty simple today these are the zara straight jeans or the high-waisted ones my favorite jeans i have forgotten them but i asked Aiden to bring them because i'm obsessed with them and then i'm wearing the same target booties my top is from free people and then my same anna luisa necklaces Works. We are back at the hotel right now. I have just been getting some work done. I just had a phone call. I successfully went out today and got Aiden some shoes. And then I also got a gift. And then I just walked around a bit. But for tonight's plans, we are going to walk the Brooklyn Bridge with Aiden's mom who's in town. And then we're getting dinner at a place called Bubby's in Tribeca. It's like a southern food kind of place. And then I think we're also gonna walk around Brooklyn Heights. So it should be a good night, but it's about 5.20 right now. I need to go ahead and change into something because this is definitely too hot for today. Good morning guys. It is Thursday. I just finished getting ready. It's about 8 o'clock. I'm just wearing this white tee and the same jeans from yesterday, but very simple because I'm headed up to see my friend Isabel. She was one of my bridesmaids and also just like one of my good friends from college. And so I'm headed up to see her. She lives like an hour outside of the city. So I'm going to take the path train to Hoboken and then take New Jersey Transit to see her. And I'm so excited. I don't know what we're going to do because it is going to rain, I think. We talked about doing apple picking or something fun because there's a lot of that up there, but we'll see what exactly we do. That's why I just wanted to wear something really casual in case we end up walking or something. Aiden's mom is in town, like I said, so he's going to hang out with her today and I think later tonight we're gonna meet up with my brother and Avery so another jam-packed day I am really excited I'm probably gonna head out here soon in the next like 10 minutes um, I always get nervous taking these trains I don't know why because they feel so much different than the subway especially the New Jersey Transit because if you miss it it's only running every hour so I want to make sure I get there on time so I'm gonna make sure to leave decently early again. I 
feel like that's the theme of this is vlogging clips when i'm out but then talking back in our saunder it was a pretty chaotic day today the path train this morning broke down and so i was like waiting on the train waiting on the train kept being delayed and then finally i just decided to uber because i didn't want to miss the train to go to see my friend i guess it was under construction for the stop that i needed to go to and so you're supposed to transfer at the station but i couldn't understand what she was saying and then i asked her and she was like that stop was way back there that you're supposed to transfer and i just didn't know so i ended up having my friend pick me up but it was so nice to see her isabel's in a very just similar life stage as me and so it's nice to have like a kindred spirit that you feel like you can relate on with a lot of stuff and I just look up to her too because I think she's in a really good spot with her faith and in her marriage so she's just a really sweet friend to have that I don't get to see too often so it's always nice to get to see her. Came back, back in our saunder. I'm very comfy right now. I don't really know what we're doing for dinner tonight. I ended up telling my brother I'm going to see him tomorrow just because it was such a chaotic day getting there and we'd have to go back uptown to meet them and so i was like i'm kind of over the train for now so i don't know what we're gonna do i think we're just gonna meet up with aiden's mom again he's on his way home from hanging out with her and grab some dinner but until then i'm just gonna chill i love coming back to this place i know i keep saying that but it's seriously so nice and just so comfortable and so cozy especially when the sun starts to set like it's so nice and it really does make you feel like you live here finished getting ready it is friday and it is a beautiful day we thought it was gonna rain today but it ended up being so nice it's like 65 right now i think it's gonna get up to 75 for today's plans we are gonna meet up with aiden's mom and we're going to a very exciting place which i will show you guys when we get there it's a place that i love a lot and i'm sure you guys can guess what it is we're gonna meet up with my brother at Avery and hang out i think in central park and then tonight aiden and i are gonna go on a date at one of our favorite spots so it's gonna be a really fun day i'm gonna show you guys my outfit i wanted to wear something comfy since we're gonna be out today this is a dress that i rented from newly but it's originally free people and it's so comfy and cute i love it i wanted to wear boots but because they're gonna be walking around today i just figured i'd throw all my same sneakers i've been wearing i feel like i keep going out and not recording and then coming back and talking but it was so much fun getting to hang out with avery and derek and just to go see levaine for tonight's plans we're actually going to one of our favorite restaurants that we used to go to when we were dating it's called el matote in the upper west side they have really great margaritas i honestly like them more than texas ones they're so good so i'm hoping we'll be able to eat there tonight if it's not like too crazy but i just went ahead and changed and we're headed out again it's about six o'clock we've been here for like an hour we're heading back out the sunset's so pretty tonight i'll show you guys another outfit of the day i feel like this whole vlog has just been showing my outfits my dress is from zara it's just like this little silk dress I'm wearing the same cardigan from target and then they're just like these kind of faux boots because it's actually somewhat chilly outside our last day here it is saturday our flight is this evening so we are just spending the day in the city and then we're gonna go head to our flight we're checking out of here at 11 we're gonna go meet derek and avery for breakfast this morning and then probably just walk around the west village because that's where we're eating it's like 
one of my favorite neighborhoods and trying to see all of our favorite neighborhoods while we're here so we're gonna do that last night was fun so we actually ended up meeting up with a lot of our old college friends and we were out to like one so a little bit tired if i look tired that's why definitely bittersweet i feel like we had so much time here though which was really nice we really got to do a lot a very jam-packed trip so i'll show you guys what my outfit is today my dress is again from zara i think it's so cute and comfy i'm also wearing shorts under it because it's kind of short so if you see that and then these are the same naturalizer boots that i've been wearing Sunday. We got back last night and I never closed off this vlog so I wanted to close it off and just say a couple things because obviously this was something that I was really looking forward to but also nervous about. When you live in a place like New York it's just so different than any other place and it really has just such a lasting impact on you and so being there I can't explain how it brought up all those memories and just really took me back to when I grew up because I was there and I was 18 to 22 and I know it's not that dramatic but that age is is just such a pivotal time of your life like 18 to 22 that college time and so I just grew up so much there and had so many memories there that it was so special to get to be there and to be quite honest I did miss it more than I thought I would I thought I would go back and kind of feel completely over it but I think that's a good thing I mean I was on the plane ride back and I made a TikTok about this so <laughs> when you're on the plane you just overthink everything about your life and you just like start crying that happened to me on the way back not because I miss it in a way when I used to live there it just made me nostalgic for being that age and growing up there and also just seeing family I think it's so hard when you're in like a big family to really keep up with everyone and really invest in your siblings and so it was so nice to get to see family and just to be there and yeah it was a really great trip I missed having that energy it's just an energy that only exists there even in other cities when you live in there that energy is so nice I do think there are things that I appreciate now about my life here being able to slow down being able to just think more than when I was there kind of getting caught up in the always going I do find myself kind of pursuing material things more like just me and my personality more there and yeah there are things that I like things that I don't like but overall it was definitely so much better than I expected and that's a good thing I think a lot of times you can kind of get sad about that and sad about kind of being back but I'm really content I just had a day of getting everything together today and it was just such a great trip because it made me appreciate things that I have here now while also being thankful for the things that I had at that time in my life. I definitely plan on going back more in the coming years, but yeah, New York is such a special place. I think if you ever have the chance to live there for a period of time, I'd highly recommend it. I think you just grow up a lot and there are obviously pros and cons to everything. I did forget about how expensive it is. That is something that I appreciate so much more about here. It's much easier to kind of live a comfortable life with less, but yeah. I think it can be worth it to a lot of people. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog. I tried to really get a lot of content out. If you guys are new, feel free to subscribe. I post twice a week usually, sometimes once a week when I am just a little bit busier. So I posted a ton on my Instagram this trip. I have like a New York City highlight if you want to see places we went, if you're going. It's just at Michelle Reed. But thank you guys for watching and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye friends. Thank you.